Um, there is a thing here. Where? Oh, nope. Yep. Yep. Let me step over that shit. Coming, Rocho. Locker key. C1. Oh! Trying to go see what's in that locker. Alright, cool. Um. Alright. That's that. Alright, cool. Where are the lockers here? There. Alright, let's go do it. Wait. I have double shaft. You do not have the skill required to equip. I don't. What now? that shit. Ah, whatever. I've got him on me anyway. It's not a big deal. Hmm. An email. Hello again, sir. This is Tanabe from Happy Net Online. Have you come to a conclusion regarding your modem contract? Damn. I forgot I gave them my email. Guess this isn't as over as I'd hoped. email what do you wish to do about your contract sir please be advised there will be quite a large cancellation fee if you opt out the language they're using is getting more and more suspicious mm -hmm. an email this is happy net online we will contact you again soon with further details they're not going to leave me alone while I have their stupid modem. I guess I have no choice but to solve this in person. Alright. Oh, I just have C1. Green box. Do I seriously not have any other keys for these? I guess where I did. There's any other yellows? Okay. Um, I got the green box. What's in the green box? Okay. I forgot what he wanted me to do with it. Um, 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 Did it? Oh, 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 mm -hmm. I gotta answer. Load them, boys. Hello. Greetings, sir. This is Tanabe from Happy Net Online regarding the contract you signed earlier. Go on. You can spare us a few moments of your time today. We would love for you to come and ask your questions in person. Mm. Sure, I can do that. That way I can give you back your damn modem. We look forward to your arrival, sir. We're located in the same building as Lullaby Mahjong, on the third floor. I know where that is. I'll see you soon. Wonderful, sir. D3. Oh, it is. You are correct. Thank you. Stop this light. Okay. And what I was looking for... Probably gear... No? Ooh. Sengoku armor. Attack goes up, defense goes down, and bla You know what? Fuck it, I don't care. Attack goes up. That's important. Always important. Um, and then inventory. Ah, there it is. A device that makes a sound when a locker key is nearby. Oh, nice. That's just normal. Alright, cool. This 
Christ. Hiya. Looks like you got your hands on my box. There was... There was a webcam, I'd be looking directly into it with a face of confusion. Now take it over to the guy in the suit behind Shine. He really doesn't have the right tone for this kind of job. I'm the one who got myself into this, though. Guess I'll find this guy in the suit behind Shine. Okay, and that's... It's Lullaby Mahjong, that's where I need to go for things. And then Shine is located... Here. I gotta go all the way to Pink Street? Shit. Actually, that's not too bad. Um, yeah, that's not too bad at all, actually. Well, I'll do the Happy Net office first. After I beat these guys' asses. sword there I wanted to use on this one. Komaki's people, Brawl Electric Boogaloo. Well, you managed to beat Nakao Fujiki? Very impressive, kiryu -san. Though there is another guy who has you in his sights. Compared to his brother, he's a bit more of a muscle head, which means he also packs a stronger punch. He's near the hotel district if you feel like taking on another challenge. Thanks, Komaki pupil. Import adult goods. The red lights. Where was it I was going? Oh yeah, it's in the street over. Um... No. No, you don't see me. Liars. There's shine. And then here. Over here. Y'all can't, can't see me. Unlike John Cena, motherfuckers. I'm apparently supposed to give this to you. So, you're working for him? Uh. I guess you could say that. Okay. I'll transfer the money right away. I should know better than to ask, but what exactly is in this box? Yeah, you should know better. It's none of your business. See you later. Hiya. For your last task, get your butt over to Camaro Theater. Find the guy with the hair and ask him how many bells he needs. Well, at least the end of this madness is finally in sight. I should head to Camaro Theater and get this over with. Where is that? G-Star. Ah, over there. Okay. Nope, wrong direction. I'd like to prevent getting into a fight if I can. This guy just moves so damn slow. Ah, god damn it.
Nice. Nice. Right. No. Yes. Well, well. Look for the guy with the hair. Uh, he's probably down here. Yes, that was correct. Um, maybe less correct. Ah. You looking for something? Hell. How many bells do you need? Oi. You? Say your prayers, you son of a bitch. What? Nani. What did you attack me for? Some guy named Massa. Emailed me about a job. All it said was beat the crap out of the guy in a suit who asked how many bells I needed. Looks like we've been tricked. Nani? Tricked? The hell do you mean by that? I'm here on a job for Massa too. He said you'd pay me if I asked about the bells. I don't got any cash for you. Likewise. I don't think he planned on paying either of us. He probably told you to attack me, so I'd be quiet. Best case, he'd get a double takedown. <sighs> that two-timing piece of shit. Guess there's no cash at the end of this string after all. But he must have known one of us would win, and he would need us both silenced. In other words, he's probably nearby, hoping to finish off the winner. Cool. Stop right there. That's my chase music that I made with my mouth. My controller just rumbled for no reason. I know this alley. You corner now, Massa. It's time you started talking. <clears throat> damn, damn, damn! Why don't you just die like you were supposed to? I've got to finish this myself. Ill natured man. <laughs> Oh, nice. Your face is on fire. <clears throat> how, how are you so strong? I get to ask the questions here. First, what was the point of all that? What was in that box? Boy. You won't talk. I can always beat the answers out of you. Yep. Please, I've had enough. It was a high-powered surveillance camera. Mm -hmm. A what? <clears throat> it's a device you can use to monitor people without them knowing. That's how I tracked you. Kind of an expert. It was just a job that I didn't want to take personally. So I set you up to do it for in my stead. You know, in case it went south. Pay you however much you want. Just let me go. Oh, it's fucking sweet. Alright, cool. <sighs> Don't you ever pull people into your messes again. I'll get lost. I, I'm sorry. I knew this was going to be fishy. Alright, cool. Well, now I can go and pay this dude to beat his ass. Oh, Jesus Christ. Hiya, pal. Sorry for all the fuss. It's me, Masa. I was wondering how about you and me team up? I'm blocking this creep. There we go. Alright, get out of the way. Come on, lady. Ooh, hold on. What's that for? Oh, 30 sub stories. Nice. Nice.
Nice. Um, this way and then south. Oh, you know what? Now is the perfect time to get some ramen because I am low on health. Um, yep. Hello. Welcome, welcome. Welcome. What will you be ordered? Oh, uh, let's see here. I got this last time. I want this. This. Kiryu will be full if he eats any more. Being all full will replenish health, but not grant effect. I, that's fine. Need health. I'll eat that. Some fried rice. Some gyoza too. Meat and everything. Meat and all. Cause I need health. I'm gonna be so full. Eat the dekimos. There, I have eaten everything on your menu. I hope it pleases you. Thank you very much. Come back again. Hey, Kiryu san. Thanks for all the business. How much of the menu have you tried at this point? Nothing warms my heart more than a repeat customer. I could eat the ramen you make every day. It's really that good. Man, I wish all my customers were as friendly as you. You know what? From now on, if you ever need my ramen in a pinch, I'll give you. I'm, I'm gonna have a nice hot bowl waiting for you. Yushu Star, no, number one star owner, is now your ally. Nice. Soup sack. That's what that means. And all it took was eating all of his ramen. And some gyoza. And fried rice. Um, okay. Back this way. Yeah, fuck off, guys. Oh, thank you for the bat. Oh, don't thank you for the bat. Wait, did I just break my- Oh. Oh, I thought I'd burn it. Lame. Attacking lame. All right, I've got your hundred thousand. Let's do it. Okay, I don't want to be hunted anymore. Wonderful. Let us commence. <laughs> it appears the ritual was a success. Oh. Wait, that's it? Ah. Yes. The horror that walks beside you is no more. And now that the devilists have tasted you, you will be susceptible to their influence forevermore. I fear it is only a matter of time before another twisted spirit latches on. Do not fear, I can assist you there. Oh, exactly. This stone it is a magic crystal, powerful enough to ward off even the most malicious specters. Stones this large are unimaginably rare. Really. Just so, the 300,000 yen I asked for, it is but a small price to pay for its immense spiritual purity. Here, would you like to feel its power yourself? As long as I'm holding it, I'm safe. Correct. And I nearly forgot that you shall not need to recharge its power in this holy vase. For only 500,000 yen. Jesus fuck, man. Aha. <laughs> ah. Uh, cool. Something wrong? <gasps> Over there. What are you talking about? 
Don't mediums deal with ghosts all the time? I'm not a real medium. Look, man, I was just in it for the cash. I never thought I'd actually start seeing ghosts. I'm out of here and take your damn money, too. I got my 100,000 yen back. What about your magic stone? It's just a stupid rock, pal. Keep it. I'm done with this shit. Boy. Hey. Hmm. I dropped that tape. Maybe it was cursed after all. 